Have you ever wondered how the internet, this vast global network you're using right now, came to be? Our journey begins in the swinging 60s, with the birth of ARPANET, the Advanced Research Projects Agency Network. This was the first network to implement the protocol suite TCP-IP, which became the technical foundation of the modern internet. In 1969, a significant milestone was achieved when the first message was transmitted over this network, marking the dawn of internet communication. The development of TCP-IP, short for Transmission Control Protocol and Internet Protocol in the late 70s and early 80s, was a game changer. This protocol suite became the backbone of internet communication, responsible for data transmission across multiple networks. It laid the groundwork for a world that would become increasingly interconnected. By the end of the 1980s, the foundation of the internet as we know it was laid. But when did the internet transform from a military and academic tool to something you and I could access? This leap happened in the early 90s, thanks to a man named Tim Berners-Lee. In 1991, Berners-Lee, a British computer scientist, developed a revolutionary system known as the World Wide Web. This wasn't just another network of computers. No, the World Wide Web was a gateway, a user-friendly interface that made the vast and complex internet accessible to everyday people. The World Wide Web's creation led to an explosion of internet service providers in the mid-90s, bringing the web to homes and businesses around the globe. Suddenly, the internet wasn't just for scientists or the military. It was a tool for everyone, a digital frontier that anyone with a connection could explore. By 2000, the internet had become a household name, changing the way we communicate forever. It had evolved from an exclusive network into a global phenomenon, setting the stage for the digital age we know today. So, we've got the internet in our homes, but how did it end up on our phones, and how did social media come into the picture? The early 2000s saw the birth of a digital revolution, with the advent of social media platforms. MySpace, for instance, launched in 2003, offering a new way for people to connect online. It was a canvas for personal expression, a space where you could share your likes, dislikes, and even your favorite music. Then, in 2004, came Facebook. What started as a simple platform for college students to connect, quickly transformed into a global phenomenon. Facebook allowed us to share our lives in ways we had never done before, from our holiday snaps to our thoughts on the latest news. Just a couple of years later, Twitter joined the game. With its limit of 140 characters, Twitter revolutionized the way we share and consume news. It gave us a platform to voice our opinions and engage in global conversations, all in real time. But the rise of social media was just one part of the story. The development of smartphones and 3G technology played a crucial role in making the internet portable. The first iPhone launched in 2007 was a game changer. It put the power of the internet right into our pockets. 3G technology, which stands for third generation mobile technology, enabled high speed internet access on these smartphones. Suddenly, we were not just calling or texting on our phones. We were browsing the web, checking emails, and yes, updating our social media profiles. The marriage of social media and mobile internet has fundamentally changed how we communicate and access information. We can now connect with anyone, anywhere, anytime. We share, we like, we tweet, we post. We are more connected than ever before. Today, with over half the world's population online, the internet continues to evolve in ways we can only imagine. From a military project to a global communication network, the internet has come a long way. It began as a flicker of an idea in the minds of visionaries, ultimately transforming into the World Wide Web, a vast, interconnected network that has fundamentally altered the way we live, work, and play. We've journeyed from the dawn of the internet, where it was a privilege of the few, to it going public and becoming a staple in our day-to-day -day lives. The rise of social media and mobile internet has further accelerated this transformation, bringing us even closer together in an increasingly digital world. Looking ahead, we can anticipate a future where the internet is faster, more accessible, and more integrated into our lives than ever before. Advances in technology like artificial intelligence and the Internet of Things will open doors to possibilities we can't yet conceive. As we look to the future, one thing remains certain. The Internet will continue to change and shape our world in ways we can't even imagine yet. Stay curious and keep exploring.